Okay, here we are. We're going to uh, look at a 1972 International Cub tractor, which is yellow and white. Um, here the tractor is right here. You can see right in front of me. Uh, it's a really nice, uh, nice Parmall Cub tractor there. And uh, we'll make our way around to it. I was going to get it out and demonstrate it for you, drive it around. But as, I don't know if you can see, it's actually snowing pretty heavily today. Um, it's actually not sticking, but it's snowing pretty heavily. And I uh, also have a couple other tractors behind it, so it'd be a challenge to get it out of the building. But, uh, okay, here, here the 1972 Cub. As you can see, it has, has really nice paint. It's been redone a few years ago um, by the previous owner which was a tractor collector. Um, he used this tractor primarily for cultivating his garden, so it really wasn't worked very hard at all. The differences in the 1972 versus the older Cubs is that they're painted yellow and white. They have the square front uh, nose piece. They have the belly exhaust, and it also has the deluxe cushion seat. Okay, compared to the older Cubs, like this 49, which has the round nose, has the vertical exhaust, has the red paint, of course, and also has the original uh, pan seat. Okay. So this tractor actually hasn't been started since I purchased it back around August, September. So uh, we may be dealing with a cold battery or whatnot, but uh, a dead battery. And it, this is actually a dead cold start. It's, it's around 30, 32 degrees outside, so um, we'll see if she'll start up for you. Turn on the gas. Okay. And uh, see so if I can sit my camera down here so I can start it up. Okay, see the tractor runs really well, and uh, aside being cold, well let's see if we can start it back up, she's cold, chuck it a little bit. system charges exceptionally well, as you can see. And it also has the original toolbox, which you can see right here. Warmed up now, so. Sounding 
looking a lot better. We'll have to warm it up. Let's walk around to the other side here. Tractor doesn't even smoke. Set the exhaust is right up over there. The PTO works great. Um, the tractor is really in great shape. I'll idle it down for you so you can listen to it idle. And really, that's all I know. Um, you know, the, uh, the hydraulics work great on it. And everything, so I think I ran out of gas there. Oh, yeah. But uh, it's a great little tractor. And I think you would be happy with it. And it would, it would more than outwork what you needed to do, so just uh just let me know if you need anything else thank you